Hi new reception class! I can't wait to see you next week. I've put together this little video just to show you what to expect when you come in on Monday. Okay, things have changed a little bit over the summer. So I hope you enjoy it and I'll see you all on Monday! And I've got some help now from Reuben and Leo to show you exactly what you'll do when you arrive at school. Let's go. Oh, so we're yes, coming through Julie. Julie's room into here. And we're going to walk through Julie's room and into our reception classroom. I'm going to say cut. That's it. We are, yeah. Through here. Boys, this way. And this is our classroom. So this is our new classroom. Okay, so some things have changed a little bit. When you come into the classroom, you're going to walk into this part of the classroom first, which is our little role play area. So this is our little house. You'll be able to play with the kitchen there, look. There's lots of pots and pans, a few bits for you to dress up with. And then when you come out here, there's some toys on the table. This is where we will do our maths. Um, when we start doing some learning, lots of counting and things will be going on there. Um, when you first come into the classroom, you're going to need to hang your coats and things up on here if you're wearing one and you'll be able to find your hook with your name on it and you'll know that that's where you put your things. And then the bathroom is still in here as it always was. The water fountain won't be working, but you're going to have some water bottles instead. So over here um, by the, the snack table, we've asked everyone to bring their water bottle in with their name on it. And that will go there next to the sink. And we've got some um, space here where we'll be able to blow our noses and pop the tissues into the bin and wash our hands. And there's our coats for our waterproofs and things to go outside in the garden when it's time to go outside. So just coming around here, we've got some puzzles on the table, some Lego. You might see in the background there, something's looking a little bit different. And I'll get to that in a minute. So round here we've got some drawers and each of you's got your name there on a tray and you'll be able to put your things in there, your book bags and things will go into there. We'll show you how to do that. And then you'll come and find your name and pop that into the box so that we know you're here. And there's oh, some farm animals. And this here is our message centre. So these are all the things that you'll be able to use to write and draw and Leave some messages for people. There'll be some more toys on there. Some pegs there, look, on the little table. Um, some sorting. And then this is our creative area. So you'll be able to do some painting, some drawing. We're going to put things up in the frames. There's some pegs here for you to hang your paintings on so that they can dry. Um, and then around here, here's the making trolley. So you'll be able to help yourself to whatever you need to do your making on there. There we go. And then you can see in the background there's a little mat, so you'll be able to choose one of those spaces to sit on when we do our register. And there's another table there. That's where I will be doing some writing with you and some phonics work in a few weeks' time. Not quite yet. Um, and then up here we've got different things that we'll be using. And here's our first book that we're going to read, The Colour Monster. Some little monsters there too. And this is where we'll keep our Fabulous Five books and our piggy kits when we're ready for those. And then here, this is a little bit different. This is our new door. So our classroom now is just for reception. And on the other side of the door, you'll be able to give Miss Lay and Miss Heel and Miss Ridings a little wave look through the door. Hello. They're not in there at the moment. And then, oh, this is our reading corner. We can have lots of stories in there and our story stones are there too. And then over here on the carpet, we've got our construction area. You'll be able to use the blocks, a little house there, look. And we've got our loose parts, so lots of different things for you to take off and play with there. And some boxes and tubes for you to do some building with. Over there, oh, and a whiteboard on the wall so you can draw and write on there and do lots of planning for your designs. 
And we've got a little space here that we'll be using when we start our phonics learning, but we're not doing that quite yet. And here, it's a big space. We're going to have a sensory tent in there. Big tent with lots of lights. We haven't got that delivered quite yet, but it'll be here soon. And then here we've got some books and a little basket for you to sit in and some math things. You can do lots of counting with those on the carpet there. And then back here, back to our maths board and back to our little house. There's a little table and chairs there, look. Lots of different things for you to play with and see and do with your friends. So when it comes to us going outside to play, we're not going to be going onto the big playground quite yet, but we'll be using our space in the garden. So we'll walk through our door, a grown-up will open that, and out of this door here, just like you did at nursery, onto this half of the garden. So we'll go over the bridge, and that's where we will play. And there's a little bit of orange fence there, just to remind us whereabouts in the garden we play. And at the end of the day, when it's time to go home, we'll go back out through Mrs Roundtree's room and we'll take you out to your grown-ups and say goodbye. And that will be your day in school. <laughs>